list of all of the Doom games. Now it may seem a little strange that I'm starting this with Doom 3, but having a look in and amongst ta the timeline information, they've got kind of a multiverse theory going on, but some people have put together the best way to put every Doom in a continuous story is to treat Doom 3 as a prequel to the original. So, starting with just Doom 3. The Union Aerospace Corporation is the largest corporate entity in existence. Originally focused on weapon and defense contracts, new ventures have expanded into biological research, space exploration, and other scientific endeavors. With unlimited funds and the ability to engage in research outside of moral and legal obligations, the UAC controls the most advanced technology ever conceived. Advanced technology and outside moral obligations. That's going to mix well. Mars City is the gateway to all of Union Aerospace's Mars base. All arriving personnel are processed here before moving to their assigned posts. Mars City houses the saving. Incoming transport detected. That's me. Hi. Mars approach. Dark Star with U zero seven zero sixty three passing through three eight thousand. Roger, Dark Star. Descend to 2000, set speed, contact ground on 26972. Roger that, Tower. Hey, live stream. I am. We have them on radar, sir. They'll be landing in a few moments. Excellent. <laughs> Send the Counselor Swan is sent directly to me. Yes, sir. That's a trustworthy voice. Tower, Dark Star on final. We've got you, Dark Star. You are set for lockdown. Welcome back. I can't believe it's come to this. I didn't want to come here. He left you no choice. True. But this is the last time. I'm tired of running damage control every time he makes a mess. Right. You're the control. And if that fails, I'm the damage. If that's what it takes, the Truger is going to start doing things our way. Whatever you say, Counselor. Alright, first thing we need is... to turn on subtitles, because... Why are there no subtitles? Dude. Oh, that's terrible. <coughs> Anywho, so I've never actually played Doom 3 before. I have played the original Doom and 2016, but for every other game in this playlist, I'm coming in block. Oh, that's a boring screen. Actually, I think I might have played like 15 minutes. Welcome to Mars! All new arrivals need to check in at reception. Uh, 15 minutes at a, um... Welcome to Mars City, Union Aerospace's premier research facility. To expedite your processing, please proceed directly to reception. I gotta get out of here. Will you shut up while I'm trying to talk? Oh, that's actually a point of okay. What's in the two shipment bins? Yeah, I missed it stuff. That's a point. Let's fuck it up. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't wanna. I don't wanna get arrested yet. Welcome to Mars, Marine. Hi, nice to be here. I'm gonna need you to step on one of those red squares on the floor for a bio scan. This'll only take a second. Huh? Which one's the trapdoor and which one electrocutes me? Okay, let me get this started. Shuttle Delta Tango 1 4, preparing for departure. You're gonna need to hold still. Moving around only makes the test take longer. Alright, Bioscan looks good. You're cleared for entry. I'm very bad at standing still. Stop. Oh. 
On behalf of the UAC, welcome to Mars City Lab. This facility serves as the central hub for all scientific research, Attention. archaeological Director study, Banks. and military Please report operations. to Central Administration. Goal number one at the UAC I'm is the safety and well-being of all employees and guests. To help achieve this goal, we ask you to follow all UAC corporate procedures at all times. This includes restricting your movement to areas for which you have clearance. Always remain alert and aware of what you and others are doing. If you notice anything out of the ordinary, or just have a simple question, find the nearest UAC security guard. Welcome to Mars. First time? You can just leave your bag there. I'll have it sent up to your quarters. Okay, there's a few things we need to take care of first. This is your personal data assistant. You'll need this to access all secure areas. If you get clearance for any security zones, it'll download directly. It's important, so don't lose it. I see here that Sergeant Kelly has requested your immediate attention. Head directly to Marine Command. It's just that way. Follow the signs. My name. I mean, that's my um, like the email I put together for my PlayStation. The security access code. But that's not what I actually go. Mars City anything. is a smoke-free facility. Please smoke only in designated areas. Thank you for your cooperation. for me to focus enough to read that smaller text, so... Security is concerned he may be injured and unable to respond to pages or return to his post. Please keep an eye out for Dr. Jonathan Ishiel. I've seen an underground approach to the airlock leading to the old communications array. What do we reckon? He dead? Probably dead. Welcome to Mars, Marine. <laughs> this briefing is designed to acquaint you with a few of the standard operating procedures here on the Mars Post. First and foremost, chain of command. All enlisted personnel are under the command of Master Sergeant Thomas Kelly. Sergeant Kelly will assign you to a security detail headed by a security chief. Please report to your security chief for all. I'm here because there seems to be some very serious problems. Oh, really? Do I need to remind you of the groundbreaking work that we're doing here? No, but I've been authorized by the board to look at everything. The board authorized you? Hmm. The board doesn't know the first thing about science. All they want is something to make them more money, some product. Don't worry, they'll get their product. After how many accidents? Tell me, Dr. Petruger, why are so many workers spooked, complaining, requesting transfers off Mars? They simply can't handle life here. They're exhausted and overworked. If I had a larger, more competent staff and bigger budget, even these few accidents could have been avoided. I'm afraid you'll get nothing more until my report is filed with the board. I will need full access, Dr. Petruger, Delta included. I won't have any difficulties doing that, will I? Only if you get lost, Swan. Just stay out of my way. Amazing things will happen here soon. You just wait. Let's go. I mean, these graphics are showing their age, but I think even with the latest and greatest technology, that dude would still look ugly and creepy as hell. Listen, buddy, you don't have clearance for this area. Move along. How do you know? I haven't checked my card yet. He's just assuming, looking at me and assuming I'm some peasant. Me, right, still. Excuse me. Yeah, so those suits arrived too. Weird. The UAC must be worried about something. I hear there's been more accidents in Delta. <laughs> accidents? That's good. Is that what they're calling him now? So, tell me, just what the hell is happening over there? Beats me, man. Look, all I do is repair the converters when they blow, okay? That's it. Fine. 
But what's overloading them so much? I mean, how much damn power do they need? I wouldn't ask him if I was you, man. I heard Travis started poking around and he got transferred fast. <laughs> Didn't even see him leave. Hell, no one saw him go. Was here one minute, gone the next. Lucky bastard. Yeah, I think you find he might have transferred to a um, slightly hellish outpost. Starting volunteer positions are available now. Credit compensation offered for qualified personnel. Yeah, you know what? Let's get it. Delta Labs is looking for individuals to fill critical positions. You can help with our exciting breakthrough work and earn credits at the same time. Volunteers are needed in the following areas. Teleportation. We're looking for test subjects to stress test the new teleporters. Experience tomorrow's travel technology today. Experimental stress testing a teleporter. I will pass. <coughs> medical research. Our advanced pharmaceuticals team needs volunteers to participate in exciting medical studies. Help us find cues to everything from the common cold to Ebola 7. Specimen handling. We need volunteers to help handle and track the specimens gathered through Delta Labs experiments. Health test and liability waiver will be required. <laughs> Get help. More information about any of these opportunities or blah blah blah. Yeah, all of those can go bye bye. I ain't that desperate for money. Okay, well, I am, but my marine isn't. Attention. Dr. Braddock, please report to Environment Management Office 4 Alpha. need report to Sergeant Kelly ASAP. He's in Command HQ. This is Delta Science Management. We would like to request another security team. Controls feel strange. Oh, oh, ready. Hold oh, oh, him down. Oh, 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 okay. He's sedated oh, now. What's wrong with his face? I'm trying not to swear. Oh well. It's gonna happen. Buddy. Don't waste any more time. Go see the Sarge. Yeah, which freaking direction? Well, I'm hoping this way, because that's way open. Did I still hit circle? I did. Man. Yeah, I think I found the run button. Took your sweet time, Marine. I got lost. Now, here's the situation. Another member of the science team's gone missing. Since you're the ranking FNG, you get to find him. I want you to check out the old decommissioned comm facility. You heard he might be heading that way. The only way there is through the service passage under Mars City. Program this sentry to guide you to the maintenance elevator. Hope you follow the sentry better than you've followed orders so far. We'll pick up some gear at the security checkpoint at the bottom of the elevator. Oh, and when you find him, just bring him back. Do not hurt him. Now move out. Oh, you're a dick. Totally gonna have to fight a swarm of you little bastards later, aren't I? Attention, UAC personnel. Interested in earning more credits? Volunteer at Delta Labs today. See your service branch director you for more details. You know, you could have just given me a map instead of this little thing. I do not trust him. The UAC cares about the quality of life of its employees. Please, take advantage of our quality medical care services. Hey, you know this will pick up some equipment on the way, bit. Little creepy spider bot. I don't think I've seen a kitchen yet. Wasn't 
I supposed to get equipment? I want equipment. <coughs> oh, jump. Jump is good. The Mars City sublevel was one of the first multi-purpose installations built on Mars, housing storage, environmental systems, localized energy production, communications arrays, and rudimentary saving. Welcome to the dungeon, Marine. Most unexciting place on Mars. I'm gonna need you to grab some armor and secure your pistol before I can pass you through security. Okay, grab your gear. Excuse me a moment. <coughs> <coughs> you're now you're ready for combat. Let me do a radio test. Well, changing weather. Mars sec radio check. Excellent. Good signal. Can I have that one? Please. Looks like you've been assigned the decommissioned comm facility. Just follow the main passage through the underground junction, then straight out. You'll have a quick evac. And what better way to see the Martian surface than to run across it? Alright, under settings, can I actually look at the controls? Yes. Flashlight, change weapons, shoot, use, jump, reload. Look, crouch, move, run, special weapons. Okay, you're all set. Oh yeah, keep in mind, civilians are working down here. Don't get excited and shoot at me. This is Grant Baston, your environmental services supervisor. The date is October 19th. I've been hearing an alarming number of reports on some, uh, unexplainable things. Being on another planet and working underground has always been a little spooky, so we always have the occasional report of strange things. But what is worrying me is the fact that the number of these reports are up by a lot. People are truly frightened. The rumors we're hearing about experiments from the Delta Complex are not helping. The power fluctuations aren't helping at all either. Having the lights flicker constantly and losing power for several minutes at a time is scaring everyone down here. I'm doing my best to keep people in track, but we're continually shorthanded. Someone's reporting in sick almost every day. I'll keep my director apprised of the situation, and we'll continue to log reports as I get them. It's just that the science team demands a lot out of these things. Enough excuses. Just do your job and get the science team what they need. Jeez! Do you make a habit of sneaking up on people? Everyone's already on edge down here with all this strange thing. Hey, you're that new guy headed for the old comm center, right? You better hustle up, pal. This passage doesn't go all the way there. You'll have a quick walk outside to the center's airlock. Hey, don't sweat it. Your suit's got plenty of oxygen. It's a hell of a pressure change. Oh, 
TIE fighter I heard. Holy crap, that is not plenty of oxygen. I can hold my breath longer than that. Maybe it looks like a something. I can not pick it up. Marine, this is Sergeant Kelly. You need to double time it down there. Search your assigned area and haul your ass back to Mars City. Out. I'm doing it. I mean, sir, yes, sir. Radio off. I'm doing it, yes. Must let me get this communication out. They have to be warned while there is still time. Assistance I can't let. I, you don't know what I've seen. You can't possibly understand or comprehend. The devil is real. I know. I built his cage. I'm getting abnormal readings here. This is bad. God. I can't hold these levels. We're losing it. God help us. Again, fall back to Marine HQ and await further. Leaders, give sit reps. Over. Command HQ, this is Bravo team. We've got one Marine down, two wounded. Command HQ, this is Fire Team 4. We are inbound and out the Command HQ, this is Fire Team 2. Main power systems down in sub-level. Backup and life support systems only. We've got lots of civilian casualties. It's a mess. Command HQ, attempting to secure the area.
but it's very pretty by doing these things. But... Ow! Ow! Oh, yeah. You bastards, please stop surviving my life. No! 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 All units, this is Sergeant Kelly. We don't know what we're up against. Repeat, we have negative ID on the assailing force. They mean as no They don't have a clear path back to AQ. Stock up on ammo, establish a stronghold, and keep them at bay. Yeah, I can see where this doesn't work, you see. the nearest station and set up a CP there. Out. Yeah, I saw that coming. Ooh. This is Sergeant Kelly. Fall back to Marine HQ and await further orders. City is the gateway to all of Union Aerospace's Mars base. All arriving personnel are processed here before moving to their assigned posts. Mars City houses the primary marine upgrade that's saving. Saving always pops up when I'm reading the loading screen. All remaining marine units, this is Sergeant Kelly. I am unable to reach Mars City from my current position. Ow. Move to Marine HQ to regroup and await further orders. Shot them in the face? I shot them you in the face. Look, where are the supplies? Did somebody else take hey, the you. supplies? Up here, quickly! Where? Ladder, I'll be there. I thought I was the only one still alive. I can't believe I found you. Something happened. I don't know what. what? It, it was like a shockwave. It, it passed through the entire base. It started changing. It was crazy. I was working up here on the vent shafts. I don't know how I survived. Go for help. Please. No way. I'm staying up here. It's the only safe place. What's up, Chuck? Sneaky, 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 sneaky. I always suck at Be careful. Sneaky. I don't know what's in there. I mean, don't say shit like that. That's alright. Shot 
This is Specialist Wilson. My team is gone. They're all dead. I'm running blind here. What are my orders? Over. Specialist Wilson, this is Sergeant Kelly. Stay sharp, son. Move to your last known RT and fortify your position. You'll find you. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager assigned to power production dated October 18, 2145. The current operational status of the grid is 23% over nominal capacity. 
I've increased work shifts to 12 hours a day for all personnel to keep up with demand. The constant and increasing load from the Delta complex is causing havoc. This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager assigned to Pop. Oh, that's not... This is the audio log of Frank Delahue, engineering manager assigned to power production, dated October 24, 2145. Reclamation problems continue to plague the main processor. Two more valve overloads on that unit in just the past week. These overloads can destroy the valves, causing very dangerous fire, jetting with enough heat to incinerate sensitive equipment nearby. To date, we've had only one reported injury as a result of these valve failures, and this is due in large part to the quick response of the engineering team. Our procedure of entering the failure code 842 in the operation terminal has proved adequate, and I recommend no changes in that procedure. still alive. I'm unable to return to Mars City. All passages out of the Delta complex have been blocked. I'm setting up a command post here. I can monitor status reports of the entire base from Delta Central Authority and communicate with other Marine teams. It's your mission to link up with Bravo team and get that transmission sent. Head toward Alpha Labs. It's the fastest way to find them. I'll update your PDA security clearance from here. Good job, and good luck, Marine. I'm not really feeling the fear of a horror game, but I'm also not feeling the badassness of a Doom game. So. They have perfect aim while being shot. Well, I bounce all over the place. Excuse me, I killed you. Alright, I'll come get it in a few minutes. 
Yep. Yeah. have been here. Where the hell am I going? This is Mark Stanton, Manifest Controller currently stationed at Mars City. I'm not sure who to send this to, so I decided to send it to quite a few people. If you're on the recipient list, please take a moment to review this report. It is quite important. I'm very concerned over the shipping procedures out here. I am the Manifest Controller, and as such, I need to be informed of everything coming in and out of Mars City. Someone here is subverting my position and preventing me from getting data on things being shipped. This is unacceptable. Not only could this reflect poorly on my upcoming review, but this is my job and I'm tired of being out of the loop. I have no idea who keeps telling the shipping crews to allow things in and out without allowing me to produce or procure the manifest, but whoever it is, it must stop. One of the dock workers actually told me to piss off when I tried to stop one of the last containers from going straight to Delta. I immediately filed a report and will follow up with the transit manager next time I see him. End of log. <laughs> The UAC is here to help you. Psychological services are free and confidential. Marine, if you run across any operational sentry bots, use them. Those guys pack a lot of firepower. I'm alive. Awesome.
Firepower they can get. Sending that transmission is critical to our survival. Sleep, sleep. I don't think you understand, Dr. Petruger. No, I understand everything. I'm telling you now, Doctor, the UAC is taking over this operation. Operation? Is that what you're calling it? The situation is out of control. It's not out of control, Swan. You are. I'll manage this, and you and your flunky will be taking control of nothing. Do you understand? Yes, Petruger. I think I do understand. Okay, plan B. Welcome to the Alpha Labs. Okay. Formerly designated Phase One. Oh, 
Stop, buddy. There's nothing you can do for me. They're all gone. <coughs> Surprised us. They just came out of nowhere. There's still a few squads operating. But they're all cut off from each other. Try to find them. What is this for you, Red? came from here. Why are you saving as I go back? Well, you went there last time. Five six six five five six. 
something like that. Not that. All right. Don't make me get up and come close. Five, eight, six, four, four. Welcome to the Alpha Labs. Formerly designated Phase 1 by the Union Aerospace Offworld Research Division, the Alpha Labs began construction on October 29, 2095, and became fully operational July 17, 2130. Originally created as the prime science and research facility, Alpha Labs are responsible for the development of leading edge technology, such as the Elemental Phase Deconstructor, Hydrocarb, and molecular fuel storage compressor, all presently being utilized right here in the Alpha Labs. These endeavors have allowed for much needed expansion into the UAC's current leading research facility, Delta Labs, where Union Aerospace is opening all new opportunities for research and development. With continued investment and hard work, the Union Aerospace Corporation strives for excellence and is committed to building a better tomorrow. to me. Tactics bullshit. Very animated.
Hey, hey, look at that. New PDA right near a storage locker. Free stuff. Excuse me. What's your bloody code? Free stuff. ID number? 14 team reports there's some sort of unidentified growth taking over parts of the base. I don't know what it is, but it can't be good. Stay sharp. There is an unidentified growth. Chain saved. Yeah, that is not a good combination. aren't responding. I can't get root access to the systems. We can't do it here. We'll have to access the system somewhere else. All right, let's go.
guys are idiots. Freaking lost. What? By the Union Aerospace Off World Research Division, the Alpha Labs Where began construction going? on October 29, 2095, and became operational lab. July 17, 2130. Originally created as a. Executive officers? No, oh, I've executive officers. Bad guys still falling in, I'm saying, I'm guessing it's supposed to be bad guys. Access granted.
Lab Sector 1 houses the Elemental Phase Deconstructor and Hydrocon Systems, a revolutionary new technology that transforms raw materials native to saving! Marine, I've received a report that you haven't reached Bravo Team yet. You need to pick up the pace. You can't wait for it. Reaching the communication facility quickly is imperative. You are an impatient ass. Alright, well. It's getting officially late and my controller's battery level is not great, so we are going to call it there for tonight. So, thank you very much for coming down to watch and having a laugh as I get lost again and again. And you can all watch me get lost again next time. Until then, have a good one, stay safe.